Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how to perform file backup, disk backup, file restore, and file migration via Wondershare uBackit. In part one, I will show you how to backup files automatically. First, go to Backup and Restore option from the sidebar and click on the Create New button. Then select File Backup. To efficiently locate the files, you can search the files using keywords. After the search option, if you still cannot find the files, you can filter through the file types, such as image, audio, video, document, and etc. Once you finish choosing the backup source, click Select to go ahead. The software will show you the storage devices. You can choose to store the backup copies on the USB flash drive, external or internal drive as you prefer. Then right-click on Backup button to initiate the backup process. When the backup process completes, you can rename, view, or restore the backup copies. More importantly, you can set an automatic backup to schedule the backup daily, weekly, monthly, or in real time. The default mode is real-time backup. You back it will record every changed points of the backup files. Well, that is the steps to backup files. Now let's come to disk image. First, go to backup and restore option from the sidebar and click on the create new button. Then select disk backup. Click on the disk that needs a mere backup. Then click on the select button to proceed. You back it will show the storage device. You can choose a desired drive to store the disk image backup. Do ensure that the storage space of hard drive is large enough to load the backup copies. Next, right-click on the backup button to go on. Wait patiently till the disk backup process finishes. And you can rename, view, and restore the backup disk. Likewise, you can also set an automatic backup. You must have mastered the three-step disk mirror guidance. Now, we can go for part three, file restore. Confirm the backup copy that needs to be restored. Then, click on Restore button. You back it will restore the files to the last version. If you want to restore a specific document to a more earlier version, choose View option. In the View window, right-select the one needs to be restored. From the right-side information panel, you will see the version history. Preview the file to check whether it is the version you want or not. Restore the confirmed version to a desired location. Click OK to initiate the restoration process. That is the instructions for file restore. Let's jump to part four, how to migrate files from PC to PC. The first thing you need to do is connecting an external drive to computer. Choose migration option from the left sidebar. Next, click on the backup button. You can add the files that you want to transfer to the external drive. Right click on the next button. You will jump to select an external drive window. Select the storage drive and click the next button to initiate the backup process. When you back it finishes the backup process, it will notify you. The next step is connect the hard drive, which carries the important data with another PC. Install and launch you back it software onto another computer where the files will be transferred to. Log into your account. From the left sidebar of you back it, choose migration option. Then click on the migrate button. After selecting the connecting external hard drive, click next. In the interface, you can choose internal C, D, E, F drive as the migration destination. Click on the next button to start the migration process. When the files have been successfully migrated, you back it will let you know. Well, the above are methods to perform file backup, disk mirror, file restore, and file migration. Thanks for watching.